Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. If your explorer.exe is not starting and whenever you turn on the computer you're getting this error, we are going to fix it by only one single step. Not exactly one, I would say two steps. So we will run two commands to repair the computer and this third will be registry editing. So here in the search icon, click on that and type cmd. And please make sure you run as administrator and it will ask you to say yes. So you should see administrator command prompt instead of command prompt. Now here the first command is sfc space forward slash scan now. I'll maximize it so that you can type it. So once you type it, hit enter, it will begin the system scan. So if explorer.exe is not starting, not working, it is, it may be uh, due to corruption, due to infection, if, if there is any malware running in the computer, that could be a reason also. All right, so we will try to repair the computer first, okay? And once this is done, you just need to close this and again, come back here and click on search icon, type CMD, run as administrator. And this time we will enter another, a different command. I'll mention this command in the description box and you can run that as well. Uh, it's a deploy image servicing management tool. It will also replace and refresh the Windows files and it will actually repair your computer. So if there is any corruption, if any missing Windows or OS files, this will fix it. So for most of us, this will fix the problem. This might take few minutes and once this is done, you can restart the computer and see if your explorer.exe is starting or not, if it's working or not. If it's not, we will move to the next step and to do that just do a right click in the start icon go to run and type reg edit like this and click on ok it will ask you to say yes once you have opened the registry editor i'll show you what exactly where exactly we need to go so we need to go to hk local machine and then software then Microsoft, then Windows NT, then current version, and then when log on. We will go back to that quickly so that you can. So we will go to H key, local machine, and then software. Just do a double click on that. All right. And then we will go to Microsoft. Once you are done, under Microsoft, look for Windows. So I'll scroll down and you will find Windows NT, N as in Nancy, T as in Tango. Now here again, scroll down and we are looking for Win Logon. So you just need to double click on that and it will expand and go to the right side and here we are looking for Shell. So I can see the shell right here. Just do a double click on that and see if you have this value data explorer.exe or not. If it's there, well and good. If it's not, just type explorer.exe, click on OK and just click cancel it, restart the computer and this will fix the explorer.exe not starting problem and if this tutorial has helped you please hit the like and subscribe you can also run the malware scan you can also run the defender windows security scan if there is any infection that will scan the computer so you just need to do a uh, double click on the security windows security then go to virus and threat protection and do a quick scan all right so it will start scanning for you uh, if any malware is there all right so if you find this tutorial helpful, <laughs> again, I'll see you in the next tutorial. Have a wonderful day. Take care.